Hey Geminis, it's Sonny and this is your weekly horoscope for the week of March 16th, 2015. So my head itch, but I had, um, I don't know, it was a it was kind of interesting vision for you guys. I saw like a rocket or a comet. I feel like this is more of a rocket ship and it was like pretty much on fire and it was like hitting ground and two people was like standing like just looking at it like oh well there's nothing i can really do about it and then i saw this house floating in air really weird so but i want to talk about that later after i talk about my deck um i feel like a lot of you you need to get away you do you need to worry about you you need to worry about your finances and bettering your finances and you know finding ways to heal yourself because i feel like a lot of you you're so focused in on other things and things that aren't really benefiting you at the moment and honestly you know focusing on yourself treating yourself out traveling having a little spa day whatever you need to do would really benefit you and you need to get back to your happy place and like a better you because right now i just really feel like just weird like way down energy yeah you you're you need to have your crown held high like hold your head up high so your crown won't fall pretty much kind of deal but um also some of you just may still be worried about the past you are um this could be past lovers um like oh my god and i feel like like with new lovers heading your way they have a lot of the same qualities as old lovers just think about it like if someone new has come into your life have you ever thought they remind me of so-and-so they look just like so-and-so they act like you know that person that's not good um get rid of any doubts and fears when it comes to your money i feel like your money will get better eight to nine days you just need to wait for it and also um you need to change up your thoughts about money. See it as a currency. Money needs to flow. It does. So, you know, just be realistic of where you're putting your money. For real, for real. Um, you need to think more logically when it comes to women. My females. Think more logically when it comes to men. And this ties in with dating. Like, don't fall for the men who plays a lot of games. Because I feel like a lot of you are doing this um it's like a lot of men will come into your life they're either really stern and cold and seem like they're not interested or they're interested yet they play a lot of games and they're really childish find out why you attract these men and this could tie in with you know you are too busy trying to have your past and your present and you are like Picking the same men who played you three years ago, pretty much. So get rid of that. Focus on you. Find a better solution for yourself and your happiness. And I honestly feel like you will be okay. Um, Just in general, there may be someone of authority. Like if you are wanting a promotion, someone is talking in his ear. And they're like haters. Like yo, why do y'all have so many haters? <laughs> I hate that word, but it's a lot of people who don't want to see you succeed and they're telling things to the boss And they're like, I don't think she's capable of doing this I don't know if she can really do that and the boss is really like, oh, you think so? Okay Well, maybe they aren't so honestly, this is why I said hold your head up high so your crown does not fall you need to be positive have that oomph about you and that aura about you that make people look at you and be like she's happy i want what she's having like really think positive because that energy can change up a room that can and that can make people think so so much differently about you so if you are depressed and your boss sees it he's gonna think well maybe that person was right maybe they're not good for it they always seem depressed Girl, you better fake it till you make it, for real, for real. So, yeah. But I did pick out two cards for you. And ironically, Torres had the same cards. Four of Swords. And Queen.
queen of swords. And I feel like this is more you. Uh, my females, be in charge of you. Please be in charge with you. For my males, remain focused on your logic mindset. Think logically. Please do. And also, you guys need to take a break. And that ties in with my other cards. Take a break. Things will fall into place very, very soon. Like I said, eight to nine days, things will fall into place. You just, just be patient. And it all depends upon how you approach situations and how um, you appear within the world. And also, if you are in a relationship, taking a break would do some justice. But communication needs to be involved. Um, take a break from dating. Dating life will not be good for you. I feel like next month your dating life will get a little bit better if you are single. So yeah. Trying to oh my vision. Um oh my gosh. You pretty much you are waiting for disasters to happen. You are watching things crumble as we speak. Change this up now. I feel like it's not too late. Change up how you are. Be happier. If things are falling apart, find out ways to Place them and glue them back together with the house. Um, oh my God. Don't let your dreams and your foundations float away from you, which is why I said you need to be cautious of how you present yourself. Don't let your crown fall. I'm going to keep saying that. But with the two people, there may be two people trying to sabotage you and two people like looking to see what you're doing. So just be careful about that. But try to have a good week this week, my Gemini's. And I shall see you guys next week on time. Bye.